today and the title of the song is number songs so hear this one because it's very important for our numbers how many fingers in your hand how many fingers in your hand how many fingers in your hand count them together one two three four five one two three four five one two three four five count them together how many fingers in your hand? How many fingers in your hand? How many fingers in your hand? Let's count them together. Six, seven, eight, and nine. Six, seven, eight, and nine. Six, seven, eight, and nine. Ten, we count them all. Hi, hey! kids again. We're going to have our recap for our previous lessons. We started counting from 1 to 5. And we have the drills and exercises for the numbers from 1 to 5. We also learned the poem and song related to the numbers. Now for our main lesson for today, we are going to learn what is a set. Then we learn again counting from 1 to 10. We're going to learn a poem and some exercises for 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. And the last one will be a song. So that will be our lessons for today. Hi kids again, before going to our different drills and exercises, I want you to learn about what is a set. A set is a group of objects. The objects inside the set are called elements. So we have here one example, which is the set of shapes. Each side are the elements. The circle, the star, the square, the rectangle, the heart, the triangle, and the crescent. So this is a set of shapes. So we go now to another set. This set is a set of vegetables. We have inside the set the elements, which are the cabbage, the eggplant, the tomato, the carrots, the cucumber, and the squash. So this is a set of vegetables. So we finish now studying our set. I think kids, this time we're gonna learn counting fruits from one to ten. We start from one watermelon, two bananas, three papayas, four strawberry, five oranges, six pineapples, seven avocados, eight mangoes, nine apples, and ten pears. We finished counting our fruits from one to two. Now class, let's go and check the set with six elements. We have three sets in a row. First, the set of cups. Let's count the cups. One, two, three cups. We have three cups in the set of cups. Let's go to the set of glasses. 
Let's count the glasses. One, two, three, four. We have four elements in the set of glasses. Now let's go to the set of spoons. Let's count the spoons. One, two, three, four, five, six. This is the six elements that we're looking for. So what are we going to do with the six elements? The set of spoons, we are going to check it. We're going to check the six spoons because it has six elements. So we finish with our six elements. Now we go to another example. <laughs> going to check the sets of six elements. We have here the set of vegetables, five vegetables, onion, celery, cabbage, okra, and spinach. Now we go to the set of toys. We have a doll, top, robot, ball, balloon, and toy car. Now we go now to the set of school supplies. We have eraser, pencil, paper, notebook, bag, sharpener, ruler, and crayon. We are going to check the sets with six elements. And we found out that the set of toys have six elements. So what are we going to do that? We are going to check the set of toys because it has six elements. So we finish now our checking with the six elements. Now class, we're going to learn our number six. We're going to count six butterflies in the beautiful garden. Let's count counting the butterflies. Number one butterfly. Number two butterfly. Number three, butterfly. Number four, butterfly. Number five, butterfly. And number six, butterfly. Let's count it once more. Number one, butterfly. Number two, butterfly. Number three, butterfly. Number four, butterfly. Number five, butterfly. And number six, butterfly. You really love your butterflies on the beautiful garden. I think it's so amazing. Now we finished our number six, counting the beautiful butterflies. Hi again, class. Now we're gonna learn our number seven. Let's count the birds flying in the sky. Okay, have you seen a bird flying in the sky? Let's count them one by one today. Here they are. Number one. Number two. Number three. Number four. Number five. Number six. And number seven. All oh, the birds are seven up in the sky. So we finish counting number seven of the birds up in the sky. Yay! And now class, let's go and learn number seven. Let's color the set of seven yellow. The first set is the set of umbrella, which are six. Let's count the umbrella. One, two, three, four, five, six. We have six umbrellas. Now we go now to the set of stars. Let's count the stars. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. But we still have the set of shorts. Let's count the shorts. One, two, three, four. What are we gonna check now? And color them yellow. Is it the umbrella or the shirt? We'll find it out. Oh, we're gonna check and color the set of stars because it has seven elements. So we 
and it's our number seven. Now class, let's learn our number eight. Let's count the children in the pipe playing. Number one and two in the seesaw. Number three, playing ball. Number four, running. Number five, riding on a bike. Number six, playing doll. Number seven, on the slide. And number eight, on the swing. Did you enjoy counting the children in the park? I think so. You enjoyed it. Yay! Hi, kids. Let's go and learn again our number eight. We're going to learn today eight fish jumping on the river. So let's count them one by one. Number one fish. Number two fish. Number three, fish. Number four, fish. Number five, fish. Number six, fish. Number seven, fish. And number eight, fish. They're all jumping on the river. Is it amazing? Oh, so beautiful fish jumping on the river. class let's go again and learn our number nine so we're going to count the abc books on the square so let's count them one by one one book two three four five six seven eight nine we have nine books on the square how many books do we have on the square? Let's count them again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Surely we have nine books on the square. Now class, we have another review for the set of nine. First, we have five balls, set of balls, and then we have the set of pencils. And then we're going to have the set of erasers. We are looking for the set of nine and we're going to color them. Maybe you're going to color it red. Okay, it starts first with the five balls. One ball, two three, four, five. The next set of pencils are one, two, three, four, five, six. Now let's go to the set of erasers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We are looking for the set of nine, which are the erasers. What are we going to do now with the set of erasers? Because they are nine. We're going to color them red. Now we finish our set of nine. Hi again, kids. This time, we're going to learn our number 10. We are going to count 10 flowers in the garden. Okay, let's count them all. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, let's say it again. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. How many flowers do we have in the garden? Ah, are you sure it's ten? 
Oh yeah, pretty sure that it is 10. We have 10 flowers in the garden. Now we go now to color the set of set of orange. Now class, we go now to have our exercise of the set of 10. We have 8 mangoes, 7 banana, and 10 oranges. The first set of mangoes, let's count them one by one. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. We have 8 mangoes. Now let's go to the set of bananas. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, six seven now let's go to the set of oranges one two three four five six seven eight nine ten we are looking for the ten oranges which is the set of oranges as well what are we going to color we are going to color the ten oranges orange of course so we finished our set of 10. Hi right again class, we're going to have a poem entitled The Ten Little Mice. So I this way. Number one little mouse looked with them. Number two little mouse walked right in number three little mouse came to play number four little mouse ran away number five little mouse cried help me help me dinner is done and it's time for tea number six little mouse came so hungry Number seven little mouse was fat and chubby. Number eight little mouse was thin as can be. Number nine little mouse was big and bully. At last, number ten little mouse was full and happy. That's the story of the ten little mice. Do you like the poem about the ten little mice? Oh, I know you like it. Hi, kids again. It's my last one for you today. It's entitled Counting Animals. So I'm going to start it this way. One, two, three, four, five. I got a fish alive. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. A lion in a den. One, two, three, four, five. An angry big beehive. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Chickens in the pen. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, and nine, ten. We all have fun again. Ten, we all have fun again. Hi, hey! kids again. Hope you enjoy our math number five today. Hope you learn from our numbers and the poems and stories. Till next time for our math number six. Till then. Bye-bye.